All right, everybody, so I'm back. I'm Maria Avatia, and I'll be commenting for the Panthers and Ice Taki Ball of Ice Taki game. So the Panthers just lost that ball and that tackle. Ref is just calling for a scrum, and it is Ice Taki Ball. So going for that scrum again. Billy Bush is feeding through. Sending it straight to William Howard, who's gone in for the first tackle. So Manuel's taking that up a few meters from Itsuki. And again with Maka passing that on. Some awesome meters gained. That is our third tackle. Now King David charging through and still going. Gone down on that fourth tackle. Oh, Bruce has just shot it through. Fifth and final. They've done a quick grubber. And try for It's Lucky Sharks. There we go. Trying to find out who got that try. <laughs> Sorry, so that was your name, Audio, who scored that awesome try for the Ice Taki Sharks. Now it's Taki Sharks receiving and the Panthers are having a team chat. I believe that's Leo Roa going for the conversion.
Sarah Teobola on wing. Number five, who got that awesome try for Aztecki Sharks, and Leo is making that conversion. And it's a no-go. So our score right now is 4-0 to Aztecki Sharks. That was an awesome boot by the by the Panthers. Oh. And he has been called up because he wasn't behind the kicker. One of our Panther boys. So now that is Aitsaki ball once again. And they've brought that ball up. It was a beautiful boot by Leo. I hear the call. Jaws for the Sharks. And they've driven that straight through the middle. And that's our first tackle made by the Panthers. Panthers are up on their defense now after that first try. There's also back door. And Wise has gone again. Davis gained some yards for the Sharks. And they're playing again in the middle. Billy has booted it out. And that's Sharks ball. And the Panthers have taken out the Sharks down that corner. Oh, Ruff has called scrum. It's eight stucky sharks ball. William Howard's got the ball and he's taking it up. And there's Mano. The Panthers are keeping them in the same area. Sharks have moved the ball along, but they've kept them in the same area. And that was awesome hands by David. And yet another try for the Sharks. That one be made by David Polo. So that's given the boys enough time to recover. Leo Roa once again doing that conversion for the Sharks. That was no conversion. So our new score is 8 0 to Aztec Sharks.
Once again, Tupo kicking off, and the Aitstaki Sharks are receiving. That one was sent straight out to the right side, picked up by William Howard. And that's that first tackle made by two Papa Panthers. They've held position of the ball, and they're up again. Tackle three, the boys are in their red zone now. Two Papa coming up with some really strong defense. But the boys are very hungry. Oh, and he's just missed that. So now that two pop a ball. The ref is calling for another scrum. We'll see what the boys have to do now. They've just gone past their halfway line. Oh, boys, they will all come up very strong, very tight on defense, the Sharks. And the boys gone again. They've shut it down, but they've gained some really good meters, the Tupapa Panthers. Now they just hand it, and they've almost broken through. That was for a T. And the Sharks didn't manage to get a hold of them, so that was a try for the Tupapa Panthers. The boys on both sides are getting some very stern talks from their coach and their manager. To put their conversion. And it was made. So our score now is 8-6 to Itztaki Sharks. Now to Papa Reeving and Aitstaki Sharks kicking off. That was a beautiful straight down. And to Papa just caught that one. And shut down by the Sharks. And they're back up again. And that's tackle two.
forward to getting nice and low. And this is tackle four. Panthers have now made it up halfway. And that's fifth. Now we're in our fifth final. And Panthers have booted it all the way down. Receive it. Just saved by the bell. By Eddie Nicholas. So the boys have reset. Panthers are taking it up. And Seals caught that from the Panthers. Pass it back into the middle. Yes, and the Sharks have shut that down. That's their second tackle. Ref has called for a scrum. And that's a sticky ball. Oh, but the Panthers have come up on defense strongly. And David's still going. Took three boys. One was gone. And that's tackle three. Hands by Wills. And that's tackle four. And that was just off a sticky. Bounce back. Chase. And there's a chase. There's an awesome chase. And saved by a sticky. It's a very intense game. And this is just the first, first half. So that was a try for the Panthers. So conversion is being made by Gabby from the Super Panthers. And that was no conversion made. So that brings our score now. 8-10 to the Tupapa Panthers. As the Sharks, once again, are kicking off.
and Super Panthers are receiving. Go, Sark! Make something happen, boys! Make something happen! Now Leo has just kicked off onto their far ledge. Received by Kave and passed into the middle. And the boys have just shut that down from the Sharks. They're a bit slow, back up on defense, but got him down. And that's tackle three, made by the Sharks. Panthers have something up, oh. And just gone taken down. So that's four, tackle four. Boys are going up. And still going, still going. So that's tackle one. And that was a shun by Itsuki. Now it's tackle two. And the boys have made a sharp run again. But to Papa Panthers defense is strong now. They're playing off five meters from their try line. There's Jed with the ball and he's held onto it. And try. Try. So that was awesome hands by the Sharks and amazing running as well. Very strong, very strong wing. Once again, Leo is making a conversion for the Sharks. And Bruce is giving the boys a good old talk in that corner and that it's past the halfway line. Leo is making a conversion on the far right. <laughs> and that's in. That's in by Leo to another seven. So our now is 14-10 to Aitsutaki Sharks. Now to Papa Pan through Papa Panthers are kicking off and Aitsutaki Sharks are receiving. That was a great boot off into the Sharks' far right. Handed it back in and taking it straight into the middle. So that's our first tackle made by the Panthers. They passed it quickly. And it's still hands. So Waisea has got the right now. Gained some good yards, but the Panthers once again have shut that down. We go with David on the left. We've got a bit of steps in there by the Sharks. So just made it past halfway. And they've booted it off. 
It is chasing now. Covey's done a quick little bit of footwork in there. And they've taken him back. They've taken him back. And there was a hold. That's tackle two. These Sharks are really holding up the Panthers at the moment, holding them back, keeping them in their red zone. But there's been some strong running. And the Sharks have just gotten that ball, ball back. And they're charging through. King David has charged on and he's offloaded that right into the middle. That's tackle three, I believe. Two, three. They've hands it all the way out. No, it's knock on by the Sharks. So now it's two papa ball in the scrum. And the Aitasaki Sharks are talking it up on defense. They played it on the short. And Ben has just gassed it through. And he's made it through on the Aitasaki short and scored right between the post for the two Papa Panthers. That's another one on the scoreboard for the Panthers. made for the Super Panthers. Okay, so that brings our score now, 18-14 to Two Papa Panthers. This is a very tight game in our first half, but we'll see what it is, what happens in our second half. So that was Aztec kicking off and Panthers receiving. Cover has just pushed that back in. With a solid tackle by Aztec Sharks. That's Marona with the ball pumping through and that's tackle two made by the Sharks. Great tackle by Mano. 
from the Sharks. That's now tackle four. And that's a sharp ball. Oh, waiting on the call. And he's called for a scrum. They've given it back to their forward, David. But the boys in black were on him like leeches. Tackle two. And they're feeding it out to their right side. Williams taking it up. He's gone some good meters, still going. And that's tackle three. And Eddie Nicholas is taking it up. Tackle four. Billy Bush has just pulled in back door. And Jed has offloaded it to Wise on the wing. And he's just been taken. Back to one. That was a very strong charge by the Panthers. So it's still in position of Otsuki. And they're working in the middle. It's starting to drizzle a little bit, so the ball will get a bit wet on the field. So the boys have to take precautions while out there. Still in position of Sharks. And David has taken that one. That's tackle one. And the Panthers have shot them back. So the boys have to work a little bit harder this time round. And he's gained those yards back. That's tackle three. It's in it wide now. And still going. That's tackle four. Thank you. That's fifth and final. Oh no, sorry, reset. So that's That's a dead ball. There's a strong run by the Panthers made. That's tackle two. Held up.
That was a good run by Madonna from the Panthers. Now the back door. Seal to cover. And the boys have just missed them. Just missed them. So it was a try by the Panthers. The Sharks are just going to have to think about this one. I think their fitness levels are starting to get to them. But they are giving the Panthers a really good run for their money. Can't talk too early though, it's only the first half. We've got our second half to go. The rain has just started to pick up, so even not only the but also the boys running might just slow down a little bit on this on this game. I guess everyone came prepared for this one because everyone's pulled out their umbrellas and their coats and their jackets. The wind's also picked up so that could be a factor and they've just missed that conversion for the Panthers. The weather is going to be a massive factor in this game now. Everything's changed. It was dry and humid at one point, and it's starting to get very, very wet and very windy now. So we'll see how this works and which teams favor. Kickoff for Itaki receiving Panthers. Cover has just received and pass it into the middle. And that was some great meters gained by the Panthers. Tackle one made. Tackle two made as well. And shut that down real quick by the Sharks. That was Wise. Wise bowler. So it's our fifth tackle. And they're taking it out. They're booting it down. Oh, there's a light kick. And it was picked up by the Sharks. Jed's still running. And he's gained great yards from that little miss, that little slip from the Panthers. It's like he lost that ball. Back to Panthers. That's tackle one. Boys have to really look after the ball, and that's tackle two. Tackle three, the boys have just held that boy up. And the boys are starting to move around, hands it out as the siren has rung. Chase it. Oh, and they've just missed it. So our score remains for the Tupapo versus the Sharks, 18-14.
Brian Cole. That was an awesome first half from the Sharks and the two Papa Panthers. It's a crazy day today, but what better day than a Friday to be watching a good game of rugby league after our women's division. We've noticed that two Papa, they're really reliant on their winger and their, sh their fastest runner, Penny, their adopted son. Um, but also the Itasaki Sharks, they're also very reliant as well on their forwards. As they've been driving up the ball, especially with um, David Polo and Jedrick, Jedrick Ingu. It's awesome to see that both teams are very strong on defense when it comes to it, as well as attack. And both teams are showing awesome sportsmanship. It does get a little bit ugly, but clean it up. <laughs> At this point, it looks like it's going to be a very slippery, very wet and muddy game. <laughs> but on to our second half now for the Two Papa Panthers versus the Itztaki Sharks. Our halftime score right now is 18-14 and it's looking like a beautiful game at the moment. It's very tight. So we'll see who comes victorious at the end of this game. So this time round, Aitstaki Sharks are seeing it and two Papa Panthers, they are kicking that ball to them. The rain is getting a little bit heavier, so the boys, our coordination might be a little bit disorientated this time round. They do have to play it safe and play it smart in the second half. And they've booted it right down to the left side of the Aitasaki Sharks. It's just bounced back, but they've recovered that ball. All right, and Ref has just called scrum. I was on... The Sharks just missed that one, but they've just recovered that one. Bouncing back to their 10 meter defense and they're driving back up strong. Ready to take the Panthers. But the Panthers are using this to their advantage. This is their green zone. So they're doing some really hard hit ups.
Wing is open. They've fed it, fed it back in. And that's a try to the Panthers. So the Panthers are ready to set up while their man is making a conversion, attempting to make a conversion. I believe this is Gabby. And he's just missed that conversion. I must admit the fact is right now um, it's quite rainy, quite windy. So that might have played a part of why he missed that. The boys are jogging back up to kick off. And our score now is 22. No, sorry. 26-14. Sharks booted it off into the Panthers' left side. And you can already tell it's been messy up in there. Marona with the ball. And knock forward. All the boys getting up, getting back too slow on the defense. It was the Sharks getting back too slow on the defense, sorry. So now the boys have to work a little bit harder because those boys, the Panthers, have just passed their halfway mark. And that's their first tackle. And that's tackle two. Now tackle three. Good strong two-man tackle by the Sharks. And they're jumping out now. Oh, they're a bit slow. And he's just slipped through. Full back. Panthers have just scored that try. Things are starting to look up for the Panthers now. They're kind of getting comfortable with their scoring. The Sharks. I believe it's their fitness once again. And we're waiting on that conversion to be made by the Panthers. Boys are setting up once again. Conversion made by the Panthers. 
So that brings our score now, 30-14 to the Tupapa Panthers. There's that word that all the mamas and papas like to use during the game, and I believe it's Akono. So I think that's what the boys need to keep in mind, the Sharks boys. They need to keep in mind Akono, help each other out, support. That will get them a long way. Knock on. So that was a knock on. Ref's calling a scrum, and this is in position of the Itzaki Sharks. That was a good drive in the middle there. Handover. Nope, that's a scrum. In favor of the two Papa boys. Boys get up on defense. There we go. It was a good shutdown by the Sharks. It was a one-man tackle. And again, that's tackle two. Good run by Mats. That's three. They're just shooting up this line right now, up this field, sorry. The Panthers, there was a quick offload, a little bit of a slip there, and Benny's still pumping, but down, that's four. That was with Maka and Leo on that tackle. Quickly shut down by the Sharks on a two-man tackle. And they're throwing it all the way out to their wing and taken down by the Sharks. Fifth and final. No, sorry, that was handover. So now it's in position of Sharks. That's our first tackle. Now two. The defense on Tupapa right now is very, very tight. Sharks are getting a little bit frustrated. So work something here. Williams booted it down. Knocked back by Tupapa. But taken down quickly by the Sharks. Just missed through. And the Panthers are just running straight down the line. Fed it back in quickly. The Sharks have just missed that one. Try to two Papa Panthers.
Both teams are walking back to have a brief chat to see what they could improve on and what they're doing right and what's real for them in this game right now. Once again, two people making their conversion. Need it up. Safe. not look right. Our new score right now is 38-14 to, to Papa Panthers. That was a good tackle made by the Sharks. And that's their first tackle. And that's the second one now. Got up a good five, ten metres. And they're chasing that nice shut down. There's tackle three. High tackle, but it wasn't made. High tackle, called by the ref. Penalty on the Sharks. Boys have to drop back 10. And that's two pop a ball. Come on, Sharks! Get up! Great tackle made by the Sharks there. That's tackle one. Boys are all up. And that's tackle two. Oh. Great tackle by the Sharks once again. And he's just slipped through. Try to tip up a Panthers.
So we're waiting on that conversion for the two Papa Panthers. Beautiful. That was made. So our Panthers are set ready to receive and the Sharks are kicking off once again. Our score right now is 50-14 to Panthers. Leo's just taking that one. <laughs> and that was tackle one. And Jed's gone in again for the second tackle. And that was only a meter off. Bruce and Jed are there. That was a good 10 meters now. Swung it out straight to their wing. And it was forward pass. It's now yellow ball. Going in for the scrum. And it's taken up by Jed. That was a great run up. Great meters. Oh, Panthers have kept in their spot. We need to gain some yards. He's just gained that ball back. Now Billy Bush has gone in, and he's gaining some yards. He's still going. Okay, and they've just lost that as a knock-on. So it appears that one of our players from Itzaki Shacks has just been sent off. But we are commencing with the game. To pop a ball and they're going on the short. and they've offloaded that. And they've swung it out the wing. They're following where it's going and he's just shot straight through the middle. There's Seal. He's going, he's going past the back and lost it. Tackle made. Oh, no. Sorry, that was a try. That was a try.
And that's another conversion made by the Papa Panthers. So sent it straight down to the back. Sharks. And they've made their first hackle on the Tupapa Panthers. Okay, and they're carrying on. Mano has just made his hackle. There appears to be a bit of an injury from one of the Panther boys. And the game continues. So it's tackle three, two. Sorry, that was three, now four. Knock on. No, sorry, Sharks did not make it back on time. That was a very good tackle made out on that far right side. And another awesome tackle made by the Sharks. These Panthers are hungry. They're just shooting straight down the field. This is their fourth one. And they've offloaded. And lost the ball. Position to the Sharks now. It's tackle two. King David's going. And the boys didn't make it back on time, the Panthers, so now... Oh, <laughs> three And that Sharks ball. David's green, some good yards over there. Straight out to Bruce and straight into Jed. And that's tackle two. Oh, the sharks are going now. They're on a they're on a roll. That was a big pass made out to David. And he's just charged these boys off. But he's held up. It's like slamming through a brick wall. And Leo's going to pop up. Who's going to chase? And it's still a ball. So we're resetting. Boys are calling out. And Leo has gone for it. Leo has gone. And they finally scored a try. 
The Sharks have and they score to try. Putting something up on the scoreboard once again. Oh, no, no, no. I'm good, thank you. I need to crouch down. And Leo's at conversion. Yeah. Dead. And that conversion was made by Leo Roa. Brings our score now to 56. 56.20. Not bad. So Leo's picking that up and he's passed it on to Wazir. Hold the ball and he's held it, so it's tackle one. Jed's there, he's taken it from dummy half. He's charged through, he's gone the 10 metres and he's still holding on. Still charging through. And he's held there. And he's held there, he's taken up a good 20 metres. Billy Bush took that one. And the boys are getting hungry again. It's a shark frenzy out there. Leo's received the ball, he's passed it back in. And that was a great tackle. That was an awesome tackle made by the Panthers. They're passing it out to the left, and King David's going. King David's gone through, and there's three boys. Jed's shot it and bounced off the ball. Oh, and Panthers have just recovered that ball. Oh, it's on to Sharks. Position to the Sharks. That's the ref's call. They're going to play a scrum right now. And this is in favour to the Sharks. They're in the red zone. So there's going to be a, some great attack, but also some great defence. Oh, and King David's gone. Waisei has picked up the ball. And Tana has just sucked that, that down. So that's their first tackle. And he shot out and scored a try in that corner. And that was a beautiful try made by the Otsuki Sharks. So Leo is going conversion for the Itsutaki Sharks. Lining it up. He's sitting right on the left side of that field. 
And unfortunately, he's just missed that one. But what a beautiful try that was for the Sharks. Boys are now receiving to Papa Panthers are kicking off. Our score now is 56-24. King David's got that one. He's taking it up. And that was a good shutdown by the boys, but that was a high tackle. So we're resetting. Oh. So it's now Sharks ball. Pass it into King David. Tapped and gone. Oh. Quick dump by the Panthers. Playing it out to the right. Shut down once again. Two. Tackle two made. Strong legs pumping through that defense. Not quite enough. That's tackle three. And they pass it on to Leo. And that was... And that was a high tackle called, ref called it. So it's Sharks ball once again. King David's gone for that first, first hit up. Wysers did a quick, lost the ball. Okay, appears to be a bit of a scuffle going on. But it quickly died down just as fast as it started up. Now it's nice to take your ball. King David once again taking it up. And he's passed it into Wise. And that's the first tackle. a good ball. Tackle two. Just gone why say down once again. And David just that one, just missed that try. It's tackle four. They're now wide now. Sharks have gone out wide. And they've just done a quick grubber. Who's going to pick it up? They just missed it. So now it's Panther ball. Just saved that ball too, and the Panthers are going. Oh, that was a good save by Stucky Sharks. Good defense.
Now the boys are chasing, chasing, chasing. And it was scooped up by the Panthers. Just missed. Just missed. And the Sharks are running it up. And that was full time, guys. What a great game. Our final score. So final score, guys, was 56-24 to the Tupapa Panthers. That's another with them. That was a good game, especially given the conditions, the weather. It was humid and it started raining, but the boys used that to their advantage. Hope everyone has a lovely weekend and enjoy the games tomorrow. Huh? Uh, yeah, we put it in the bag because it's all wet. Uh, Tati's got it. <laughs>